Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Good morning, sir. And my aspiring, budding entrepreneurs. I've come here to tell a story. Before that, for me, when uh, Dr. Sucheta phoned me when I was in US, maybe last month, it was pretty late night there, and uh, she told me that Anil would like to invite me here today for this August occasion. For me, being here today is a matter of paying tribute to uh, Anil, who was my senior boss. I call him from Anil. I still remember the day when Adil joined. I was a management trainee and I did the induction of Anil at Colgate. He was one boss to whom I went and told Anil, 10 months from today, I am not going to be here. He asked me what happened. Uh, Tambi, he used to call me, he does call me Tambi, means younger brother. So he asked me, Tambi, what happened? Normally people give two months notice, you are giving me ten months notice. I said I am going to become an entrepreneur. And uh, I still remember that moment we were uh, sharing uh, a cabin with two cubicles. Anil uh, put all his papers in the uh, desk, in the drawer, and then said, let's discuss about your strategy. I said, Anil, I don't use such big words, only thing that I know he signed taking a plunge with uh, four other people. This morning as uh, we were discussing here, um, uh, the discussion was on what differentiates an entrepreneur from others. I said, the courage to jump. Lots of people will go to the end of the diving board, keep standing there, still gazing, worried, wondering, confused. But it's an entrepreneur who takes the dive. When I did the uh, IPO of Galaxy, I personally was involved in 150 roadshows. I always started my roadshow with a quote from St. Augustine who said, Faith is that which makes you believe in what you do not yet see. Faith is that which makes you believe in what you do not yet see and finally see what you believe in. Faith is that which makes you believe in what you do not yet see and finally makes you see in what you believe in. So, before I get into the story of uh, how we came together, etc., I would just play a corporate video of Galaxy and then come back to the story. I know that uh, now, today I will address from the mindset of a startup. Someday later, when I'm, uh, whenever I get an opportunity to address to you, I will discuss with you all about creation of the organization, um, the uh, principles which go into that, etc. But today my focus will be on an entrepreneur's startup mindset. Before that, I would like to play this corporate video. Please help me. Which is not lies, needs to be switched off. In our line of work, we need to wash our hands a zillion times a day. So we need products that retain the vital nutrients in the skin as well as cleanse effectively. My hair and skin are my most priceless assets. My entire career depends on products that delay itching and keep my body fresh and healthy always. Galaxy was born over three decades ago to manufacture speciality ingredients for the personal and home care industry. At Galaxy we believe that our consumer to chemistry approach helps us to meet customer needs in an evolving and competitive market. At Galaxy, we believe personal care starts with right ingredients, differentiated technologies, and creative formulations that come together to create products that touch consumers' lives every day. 
Our innovation funnel model allows us to customize products to meet customer expectations and consumer preferences. Today, Galaxy is one of India's leading manufacturers of surfactants and specialty ingredients for the personal and home care industries with a portfolio of specialty formulation ingredients for oral, skin care, hair care and home care applications. Our model of innovation is consumer chemistry. We have translated this into an innovation funnel model of product development that enables us to create products in line with customer expectations and consumer preferences, ensuring shorter lead times. Our range of customers include multinationals, regional, and local customers. We market our portfolio of more than 200 products to over 1,700 customers in over 70 countries. We have continuously broadened our product portfolio to meet the diverse range of customers and applications. Our strong manufacturing capabilities, long-standing customer relationships, ability to monitor and anticipate changes in the views of preferences, and our continued focus on R&D has contributed to our growth and helped us become an established global player to major FMCG products. Galaxy has been partnering global brands like Unilever, Procter & Gamble, L'Oreal, Colgate, Reckitt Benkisser, Henkel, Cavan Care, Darber and Himalaya. As part of its global vision, Galaxy acquired TriK Industries USA. And this acquisition has helped Galaxy expand its portfolio of products. Like our products are designed to clean, our technology too is focused on clean manufacturing process. We believe that sustainable manufacturing is the cornerstone of our development. From 2012, Galaxy is a member of the Round Table on Sustainable Palm Oil, also known as RSPO. The manufacturing plants in India and Egypt are RSPO certified. We recognize our role and responsibility to deliver superior and sustainable value to our customers, business partners, employees, and communities. The year was 1978, 15 days into Colgate Formal that I was as a management trainee, a thought went into my mind that if I am on my own, I will be five times more creative. Don't ask me for the math because there was none, but this was the thought that I will be five times more creative. So, I went to Shashi Shanba, who is one of the co-founders of Galaxy now. And uh, 72 of us were interviewed at Colgate. Two of us happened to join, Shashi and me. I went to Shashi and I told him, Hey Shashi, life has, kept, life has some message for us, I think. It has kept us together for eight long years, four years in Bodhar College during our BCom. And subsequently, we did our chartered accountancy, cost accountancy, etc. We were in the same for busy and so can company. And we joined Hindustan Lever as an industrial training. We all independent decisions, but happened parallel. We also joined Colgate, mm -hmm. uh, independent decision, but parallel. So I told Shashi that uh, we have uh, maybe a uh, message for us in life. And uh, he said, so strong, means let me think. Next day we went for a movie at Regal. While climbing down the stairs, I asked him, so chartered. He said, yes, Jira, as chartered accountants, I don't think we can multiply ourselves. We have limitation in terms of uh, multiplying ourselves. Uh, and uh, let's put up an industry. You can imagine two young guys, two chartered accountants, age 23, 24, without any technology, without any schooling in business management, marketing. And when Sashi said, let's put up an industry, I said, why not? 
Because one of the famous quotes which I like about entrepreneurship is by Max Lerner who said, I am neither an optimist nor a pessimist. I am a possibilist. And the advice which I give to young minds always is, decision making is extremely easy. It's one of the easiest things, decision making, provided you live your life as if your life depends upon that. That is the only carrier. In fact, I uh, recall uh, when we did our IPO at the Ahmedabad during the uh, broker conference, one of the brokers sitting in the front asked me, uh, Sir, up, uh, promoters ne 3 rupiah 40 paisa lagaya hai per share. 3 rupees 14 uh, paise per share. Is it fair on your part to price your shares at 1480 rupees? Because our issue price was 1480. So, I said, we have to pay 3 rupees. He said, we have to pay 2 rupees. He said, we have to pay 2 rupees. He said, we have to pay 3 rupees. He said, we have to pay 2 rupees. He said, we have to pay 3 rupees. He said, we have to pay 3 rupees. मित्र आप साथ में आए हमने पांच जिंदगी बाजी में लगाए हस्ताक्षर डाल सो वी बेटर आवर लाइफ सो इट इज नॉट द थ्री रुपीज फोर्टीन पैसे पर शेयर तक का वी स्टेक वी स्टेक आवर लाइफ अंटरप्रिनरशिप इज ऑल अबाउट दैट एंड इन फैक्ट आई वॉन्ट टू बी यूजिंग ओके बिफोर आई गेट शो यू कपल ऑफ स्लाइड द यूजल क्वेश्चन uh, in uh, people's mind when I go and talk would be how did you hit upon the idea? How did the group get formed? I would say destiny. That's why when I prepared this uh, PPT which I use uh, uh, when I'm invited to call, of course my narration is a story, I can go on for 10, I can tell you 10 minutes or go on for a couple of hours but I am not going to be using all the slides, but very relevant, three or four. Uh, you would ask as to how the group got formed. As soon as uh, Shashi told me uh, that uh, let's put up an industry, when the faith is strong, universe cooperates. Automatically something happened, you would have heard of Rota Parents Law of Attraction. The, uh, your vibration attracts uh, reality uh, from uh, the universe. So, came in C. R. Ramakrishna, my namesake, he was masters in pharmacy, studied in the same school. So, C. R. got enrolled. Uh, my good friend Pulas, because I lost him in 2015, uh, I met him in 8th standard, he was a man ahead of his time. He was not my business partner, but he was an influencer. When I was 20, and 2021, I was doing my chartered accountancy, cost accountancy, company secretaryship, as well as MCOM simultaneously. Kulas told me, Jira, after studying this much, you should not be employed under anybody. You should give employment to people. And that particular suggestion from Kulas really stuck in my mind and it was that trigger which made me go and talk to Shashi and say that Shashi uh, life has a message for her. So there will be moments when you will have your inner callings. Pursue the inner callings. Okay. The odds many people in fact even my father didn't talk to me for a month when I went and told him I am going to be resigning uh, from Colgate and I am going to become an entrepreneur. Whenever he is upset with me, he, would, he used to uh, stop talking to me, you see. He didn't talk to me for a month. So, the, that can be uh, signals which doesn't go in tune with your inner callings, but inner callings is the sole prompter for you. Okay. So, it was... Uh, Kulas who brought in uh, C.R. Ramakrishna, he went to Calcutta, to IIM Calcutta. 
and uh, while rowing the boat at Iron Cal, he asked Shaker, whom you saw in the film here. So Shaker is a chemical engineer and uh, Manhattan graduate from IIM Calcutta. So Kulas asked Shaker, hey Shaker, what do you want to do after your MBA? And uh, Shaker said, I want to be in business. So Kulas said that, look, Jira, Shashi and uh, CR are toying with some idea. Would you like to join them in business? Kulas came and told me, Shaker wants to join you. I said, fantastic. He always used to stand first in class, Shaker. And I used to be fourth. I thought, Shaker obviously is more intelligent than me. So Shaker became my partner. Life was that simple. Again. And uh, the four of us together, uh, of course, finally we became five. We used to dream uh, any possibility. We have considered putting up a Xerox shop. We have considered putting up a medical shop. We have considered flying a luxury bus to Bangalore. And uh, so that particular one year, I always had a feeling that there is a person whom I am going to meet in my life and there was an invisible hand which was pushing me. I still remember uh, while at Taj, we were in a manufacturing conference. Next, I went and start, sat next to the technical director, Mr. Warrior. I said, Mr. Warrior, that I know of an intelligent boy who is a chemical engineer and an MBA. I think you are the right man whom he should be. So, Mr. Warrior said, yeah, bring him along at Colgate factory 10 a.m. this Sunday. I took Shaker. So, Mr. Warrior asked Shaker, young man, which department do you want to work in? You, do you want to work in manufacturing or quality? Shaker said, no sir, I have come here to uh, seek an idea, I want to become a businessman. Obviously, I couldn't tell Mr. Warrior that I am going to be a partner. So, uh, then uh, uh, Mr. Warrior said, he asked him, what does your father do? Uh, Shaker said, he hires out domestic air conditioner. Mr. Warrior knew this boy doesn't have money. Okay, he said, why don't you make SLES? I buy three tons per month. And that doesn't require even a boiler. So we went down and one foot onto the road, another foot inside Colgate factory. I asked Shaker, hey Shaker, what is this SLES? He said, Tira, look, I am a chemical engineer, no doubt. That doesn't mean I know everything about chemistry and chemical engineering. I will have to figure out. I said, then I am also a chemical engineer. I also don't know, you don't know what difference does it make. Okay, so that's where uh, it all began. Finally, um, uh, today, as I speak, that product SLES, we sell more than 1,000 crores out of the 4,000 crores of uh, I call that as Veda Vakil, means from the mouth of God. You really don't know uh, at what time, what advice you get from the mouth of God. Okay? And um, so, five of us together, we pulled in 20,000 rupees. Each one contributed 4,000 rupees. Borrowed a lack of rupees, this was 1980. Borrowed a lack of rupees from our friends uh, in a small shed of 1500 square feet. Galaxy began with a working capital of uh, 4.8 uh, lakhs from State Bank of India and 2.51 lakhs from MSFC. That's where the story of uh, Galaxy began. I'll just show you some couple of initial days photograph. Do I go down? <coughs> These are some uh, photographs of our initial days at the Mataran where we used to go for our brainstorming sessions, you see. Next please. Yeah, this is something uh, I would like to dwell for a minute on this. Uh, Kulas introduced me to the book uh, Law of Success by Napoleon Hill and that changed my mind. Law of Success by Napoleon Hill. Okay. In that, there was a chapter on my definite chief aim. So, this I wrote on 14th of February 1979. I didn't know anything about Valentine's Day. Much later in my life, I got, I got to know uh, 14th February is Valentine's Day. For me, my Valentine's was uh, my dream. This is what I wrote. The, the idea of setting up a fine chemicals factory along with Shashi, CR and Shaker, which I am nurturing at present, 
and which is gradually growing into a concrete shape has to be executed within another one year. By June 1980, our plan should be uh, ready to get into production. We shall start our enterprise with a single factory and establish ourselves as chemical giants. I am confident that four of us together uh, would create such a powerful mastermind that we will win out this world. Then I gave a copy of this to each one and got it signed by them. So, this is something which I have always believed in. Declare to the world, what's your intention? There should be no hesitation as to whether one would, uh, I would fail or I would succeed. But then, my trick always has been whatever I want, I declare to the world, then I have no control on it. I will not, I can't negotiate with myself. I, uh, somebody else becomes the trustee and this is something which I did. It has always worked for me. Even as a student, I would write down on a piece of paper and pin it uh, in the balcony that I used to study. I want to be standing first in India. I want to be standing first in my college. Openly, anybody who comes, and comes to that room would see it. I don't care, but I make it public. That's one thing which I have learned. Yeah, next please. Yeah, this is how our factory looked uh, initially. Six glass bottom flasks, okay. And uh, when our customers said that our capacity is inadequate, next please. All that our pocket afforded, and our courage afforded was to make our uh, factory a little more dirty by making the six glass bottom flask uh, to that of 12 glass bottom, uh, bottom flask. Next please. Yeah, this was our very first biggest reactor. It's there, uh, very much in working condition even today of 500 kilos. Salutes to this reactor that uh, we are uh, here today. Next please. Yeah, okay, these are some business details, okay. In summary, uh, what started off? What started off with the investment of 20,000 rupees from all of us, uh, turnover of 12 lakhs of rupees in the first year, a profit of 1 lakh of rupees. Today, uh, our turnover is upwards of 4,000 crores. Uh, profit after tax, upwards of 350 crores with more than 1500 uh, people working with us. So much of co-creation by so many. And uh, as young entrepreneurs, I would like you to uh, remember, just don't bother about what your friends and colleagues would be earning, the kind of quality of life uh, they may be uh, leading, okay? and. Uh, the initial three years of Galaxy, I remember, the partners, five of us, we used to travel from Boiser to Bombay by third class and our employees used to travel by first class. Because obviously we had to provide them with first class pass and we knew that we can't afford to uh, travel by first class and that our time will come. When I did my IPO uh, in uh, 2018, I was in Hong Kong and uh, one of the investors, uh, he asked me, he said, Kira, I have read all the 535 pages of RHP, but tell me one thing, what kept the four co-founders together for 37 long years? I said that, look, we come from the same philosophy that money is a consequence of our existence, not a cause of it. So, when you have your faith in place, the universe uh, cooperates with you and you just don't bother about your affordability or attention on money, money will chase you, wealth will chase you. Hmm. But then, what matters is the purpose and the conviction. Yeah? And, uh, uh, hmm. okay, uh, it's not that, uh, my entire journey was uh, one of uh, right things. Of course, I'm sure we did more right things than wrong things. At least 
seven out of ten things that uh, one that should work. Otherwise, uh, uh, the journey might not be uh, all that enjoyable. And to end my talk, let me recite you a poem which I recited in 2010 when uh, we had uh, a conference to which I was invited, conference of our distributors in US. So this is what I have written. The title I gave to the poem was Dream, recited during distributors meet in, uh, at New Jersey on 6-12-2010. No start from where does it come? No start from where does it come? Everyone has and power awesome. No, no snort from where does it come? Everyone has and power awesome. Courage in the heart and hunger in the stomach. No amount of dream is a bit too much. I do write points, okay? Life is but a flow. Get into the stream and add to the glow. No one can say when comes the spark. Dream with its lights dispels the dark. Met in 1985 young minds. The strength of green galaxy it finds. With $2,000 in sixth class class, the story of a tiny business starts. With just two customers to begin from, a little shed and, a, uh, and some chemical drum, the dream was to be a chemical giant. The canvas bore a global paint. From India did our journey begin, covering 91 countries, now is our span. A formidable position in India to defend for a mighty global dream in you we depend. I am here as a listener next three days. Please show me the parts and guide our ways. In you I count your courage and logic. With grace, together, let's create a one billion dollar magic. This is what I wrote in 2010 and today we are at around 500 million. I am sure a day will come. We will be a billion dollar company. Thank you very much.